Hello guys, this is Mike from Nitro Speed. Hope you guys are doing well tonight. <sighs> doing this video. Some uh, castings from my collection. And uh, I had just started a video and did some uh, half, almost all the way through. And I had my drink here, and it spilled over everything. So I had to clean about 30 of my Hot Wheels, and uh, it was tea, so there was sugar. So I had to really clean up, mess up, and it was just a mess. I got very, very upset. So, you know, we take care of our cars, and uh, we don't want anything to happen to them, but accidents do happen. But anyway, guys... That's where we're at now, so starting this video over. And uh, anyway, we're starting off with this Plymouth Superbird. Sorry, guys, I had to get some of the dust off it. And uh, anyway, hopefully, things will get better in this video. This time I got a Gatorade, the lid doesn't stay open, so I'll never bring a cup in here again. All right, guys, let's go ahead and go to the next one. Next one is the Eight Crate. And this one Rat Black sent me last year, about a year ago. And this one was from Bill's Garage. I like the color combination of the silver and the blue. It's got real nice sample work in the back and the front. It's one of my nicer eight crates, along with the moon eyes. And, uh, so guys, let's go to the next one. There we go, guys. 57 Buick. Whoop. Okay, guys, hold on a sec here. All right, here we go. 57 Buick. Rap like also sent me this one last year in the same pack. As you can see, there were marks on them when I first got them inside the package, but I was able to buff them out. And it looks much, much better. I love the white walls on this. It has an old school look. The hood doesn't open up. There's no detail, so I'm not even going to bother to open this one up. All right, guys, let's hit the next one. 60, 60, that did 67, Ford Mustang Fastback 350 GT. And the hood opens on this one as well, but again, no detail on the engine, but that's all right. I got it on the outside, which is good enough for me. This one was from the Hot Wheels Classics, and I have a blue one coming in just like it. I knew I had to have the blue from my collection. This is more like a Spectre Flame Root Beer Brown, like, it's really a great looking cast, you know. I'm really glad I have this one. I love my uh, Fastback Mustangs. They're my favorite of all the Mustangs made, along with the Mach 1s, first series. All right, guys. Let's go ahead and go to the next one. No, let's do this one. Yeah. Had to clean up stuff, so I might have got some dust on the car. So here's a Ford Thunderbolt. I have like three of these in my collection. And, uh... And they're all, <laughs> they're all loose. And I had them in two different spots, so not realizing it. And what can you do? You know, it happens. And uh, I'm going to try and put some tail lights and get some markers so I can do the headlights and tail lights, the red and uh, gray. Yeah, that's a beautiful Ford Thunderbird. Love Ford Thunderbird. Ford 
Thunderbolt. Sorry guys, it's a little late and uh, been a great day until this happened. So, but everything's well. I got all cleaned up. So, all right, guys. Next one. Oh man, where did that do this? All right, guys. Here she is. 1970 Chevelle SS with Annie Breeze Green. And this one is absolutely gorgeous. Another Hot Wheels classic. It's got the tempo work in front and back. Beautiful casting. Love this Annie Breeze Green. Get a lot of compliments on this and uh, orange uh, Buick Station Wagon 57 to be exact. All right, let's go ahead and go to the next one. This one was also sent to me from Rat Black. And this is a Walmart exclusive, or Walmart Walgreens exclusive. That's a Dodge Coronet Super B. This is absolutely gorgeous. Love this casting. I have several of these in different color variations. This one's got the rat black you know, finish on it. And this is just absolutely gorgeous. I love the window tint and the windshields. And this is just absolutely gorgeous. Okay, guys, let's go to the next one. Next one is the one I got yesterday, and here's the 1970 Chevy Blazer. And the hood opens up, but not very much. Let me see. And I don't think it stays up either. Yeah, see, it doesn't open up very much. You can barely see it in there, and I don't want to force it, so... This is too nice for my collection. I don't want to destroy it. This was from Johnny Lightning. Rat Black's got me into ordering nothing. Mostly Johnny Lightning's anymore. And, uh... Pretty nice casting. I like this a lot. Really beautiful, and it's got some paint issue there on the passenger door. Yep. Oh no, it doesn't. Okay. Oh, it's good. It was just lint or something. But this is beautiful. I absolutely love this. Love the old Ford Broncos and Chevy Blazers and the Suburbans. All right, guys. Next one. Chevy Love, 72 to be exact, with real riders, you got a real nice tampo work front and back, this was part of the, can't remember which series this was, but this is absolutely gorgeous, absolutely love it, I know it's a premium set, I just can't think right now, but this is gorgeous, love the purple, I think they should have just left it a solid color. Would have been better than the, looks like peach color, yellow and white. Stripes on the side. Still a great looking truck though. All right guys, next one. And it's the last one. And it's, hold on a second. Oop. Drop it again. Oh, there it is. So hard to see in the dark. All right, guys. This is the AMC Rebel Machine. This one, the hood opens up, but it won't stay up. And this is just absolutely gorgeous. One of my uh, favorites in my collection. I think this is a Johnny Lightning or a 
green light. I can't remember. Even Auto World. It's one of the three. I know it's not an M2. Yeah, let's see. Yep, Johnny Lightning. This is gorgeous. I love this. And uh, I got some more uh, stuff coming in tomorrow and the next day. I got quite a few cool things coming in. And uh, can't wait for you guys to see it. I got a shelf coming in that holds like 56 cars or something like that. And uh, I ordered one case, but it didn't fall through. So I'm hoping this one will fall through this time because it's the same people. And I didn't know it until after I ordered it. So hope to God I get it this time. So, all right, guys, that's going to do it for this video. Please give me a thumbs up, comment down below, and please subscribe. And you guys have yourselves a good night. Be good to each other. Be well. And I'll be talking to you guys real soon. This is Mike from Nitro Speed. I'm out of here. See ya.